for you guys. So, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed the first two tips and the first two looks. So, now here's look three. Now, look three is for the divas out there. Um, some of you guys don't like being, there are different types of fashion styles. For the first two looks, for the funky fresh fly girls like me. Um, but... Well, like a part of my wardrobe. But I also like to dress Divalicious sometimes. So, this is a Divalicious outfit that I have in my wardrobe that I absolutely love. So, I'm just going to talk to you guys about how this is modest, but it's still hot. And you can still go out with the girls with this outfit on. Okay? So, let's get started. First thing is my hair. I took the hat off because I wanted to have like an afro ish hair so I kind of fluffed my hair up and made it nice and big so that I can just have like that, you know, that nice voluptuous hair okay I kept the same earrings on which are gold and they're from Forever 21 799 you didn't notice the first four times I first first four times I announced it okay now let's talk about the shirt now this shirt is a razorback shirt you can see and it has three different types of glitters well two different types of glitters um has the two gold it's a white gold gray, silver, and then a darker gold um, glitter. And then the bottom is like a flowy, um, uh, what do you call it? Um, what do you call it? What is Jeffrey? Uh, butler. Butler type um, top. Butler type bottom that it has. I don't know if you can see how slowly like a butler top would be. Um, so it's like that. And then I just have on my black leggings. And then I have on these bad boys. These sparkly shoes, and so they match this gold here. Okay, and um, this outfit is very cute. It's very fun. You can wear it in many ways, but I mean, to many places. But it's still modest. Um, it's still modest. So um, instead of wearing just this, I put a T-shirt here. It's a V-neck. It's but it doesn't have any lace or anything like that. Had this had lace or anything, it would be overkill with this too. So I put this simple V-neck right here to kind of cover up my boobs so if I bend or whatever my boobs aren't out you see there's nothing showing um if I want to party or dance or whatever I'm still covered okay and then also for here if you guys can see the um shirt comes short here so I put this um this cami on here and then you see it's right in the back and so if I had this all out I, don't, I wouldn't feel very comfortable so I put that tank under there to cover those little secret areas that I don't want out okay so this is a really cute outfit and let me just go through the prices for you okay so this cami was like $2 from Forever 21 this shirt was like $12 from Charlotte Ruse these leggings were $4.99 from Marshalls and these shoes were ten dollars from Charlotte Ruse. Um, and the shoes really pop it out. Like, cause I feel like if I wore the black pla platform, there would be too much, and it would be too matchy with the black leggings. So these gold shoes pop it out, and they're flat, so you don't have to wear heels to be, you know, super cute. You can wear something that's, you know, sparkly and pretty, but it's still comfortable and cute. Like if I wore heels with this outfit with just the leggings, it would just be too hoochie. But this is classy and cute. So um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this look and get ready for tip number three. Hey guys, so I'm here with tip number three for you guys. I'm bending down so you guys can um, see me. <laughs> okay, so I'm here with tip number three for you guys. And tip number three is about the hair. Um, I, I changed my hair for this look because um, your hair can make a break your look. So example, this look is very like simple. I mean this look is very like sparkly and stuff like that. And if my hair was just back like that, it would just be too simple. It would look boring. But your hair can help pop your look out. So if you have on something very simple, you can do like a very extravagant hairstyle to kind of pop it out. So you can still have your jazz with your shoes, your accessories, your makeup, and your hair without looking too over the top. Okay, so you see how this hairstyle just made, gave it that little extra diva, disco, you know, look to it without, you know, it being over the top. So your hair is very important. You can do so many different things with your hair to just kind of pop out each look that you do. So I hope you guys enjoy this tip and get ready for the next look.